What's up everybody, it's Luke James, not the singer. If you're an indie artist looking for an album review and some promo, you can hit up Luke at redmattersite.com. But what I have for you today is a review for Pills the Mixtape, made by an alternative hip-hop band from Cleveland, Ohio, called Counterclockwise. They're a husband and wife duo, Deacon Burns and Kaya Rogue, who write, produce, mix, and arrange all of their songs. And earlier this year, they released an animated film and soundtrack called Counterclockwise in Foreverland. Now this is a very experimental project, so if you're always looking for something different, you definitely want to check this tape out. It opens up with the track Short, where Deacon shows off a unique voice and an aggressive flow over a bassy beat that has electric guitar and blaring horns. After that, on Drug Dealer, Deacon vividly tells the tale of a pusher who ain't bout shit cause he ain't got shit on a hard ass drum beat that sounds like something Ice-T would have gotten on in the late 80s. Unload comes next, and on here Deacon drops a lively sing-songy flow over some mariachi horns and cartoonish pizzicato strings. As he spits that music is meant to uplift, not just get tricks and rings and chains and whips. Although he doesn't shun that, because that's a part of the game too. It's a very fun sounding track, and that along with the track Price is Right are my two favorites on here. Price is Right samples the game show theme perfectly, so it's pretty much impossible not to smile when the beat drops, and content wise, it's best described as an anthem for the hoes and the johns. Now, while the rapping is on point on this album, the production really stands out in a lot of places, because what they've done is blend and borrow from many different genres. For those looking for something smooth and laid back, there's the trigger happy track Cap'n, which brings us a jazzy vibe with some light piano keys and finger snaps. And Hit the Snooze has a similar feel. On the flip side, Cigarette Burns and I Don't Give a Fuck both have a very cool industrial type of sound. And it's this varied production throughout the tape that makes it so interesting, because it's not monotonous to listen to, and Deacon can hang on all of these styles. Kaya also throws in some light background vocals from time to time, and it's a nice added touch. Other tracks on this tape include The Rent, where Deacon spits that relationships ain't nothing but a gimmick with a budget, over top of a more commercial sounding beat. The bassy, piano, and strings Dr. Dre style beat has a lot of knock to it, and the song Suppository has a comparable sound. But the line, I put a pill in her booty hole, and some of the other dirty lines, are a little bit cringeworthy. Not to mention that this song has fart sounds throughout it. So if you're into that type of humor, that probably won't bother you, but if not, you're probably not going to like this track. Now there aren't many features on this tape, but I have to mention Beat Effect, because he absolutely killed his verse on the song Bullseye by using a rapid fire, tongue twisting flow. This track has a really unique feel to it, because it sounds like it was sampled from a cuckoo clock, and while that might sound like it would be annoying, it's actually not, and it makes for a pretty bouncy beat. So when I first listened through this tape, I wasn't sure how I felt about it, but the more I listened to it, the more I came to appreciate it, because it's so damn different. And that's the strength of Counterclockwise. They don't really sound like anything else that's out there right now. I found this tape to be a very fun and enjoyable listening experience that was different, but not too far out there. But it does kind of feel like they're still in the process of mastering and perfecting their own exclusive style. Still, I would recommend this tape to anyone who likes alternative hip-hop, as well as to those who are just tired of the same old shit from rap music. So I give it a 3 out of 5. That's just what I thought about this tape. Make sure you check out the information underneath this video so that you can find Counterclockwise, hear their music, and watch their videos. As usual, do all that good YouTube and social media stuff where you like, you share, you comment, and you especially subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next time.